بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم سٹوڈنٹس مائی نیم از بشا خان اینڈ آئی ایم فرام ایم گرامر اسکول اینڈ کالج آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو ٹیچ یو بایولوجی اینڈ دا ٹاپک آف آر لیکچر از فرام چیپٹر تھری بایو ڈائیورسٹی اینڈ دا ٹاپک از ڈی فارسٹیشن اوور ہنٹنگ اینڈ اسٹیپس فار کنزرویشن آف بایو ڈائیورسٹی It is present on page 43 and 46. Learning objectives includes first of all deforestation, definition, causes, effects, advantages and threats to biodiversity. Then comes over hunting. The third one is conservation. The subtopics which comes under conservation includes introduction, explanation, threats to biological resources in Pakistan and the last one is causes of loss of species and habitat. Then comes IUCN and WWFP. And the last one is organization or projects work to conserve species and habitat. Then comes endangered species in Pakistan. It includes Indus Dolphin, Marco Polo Sheep and Hubara Bustard. Now comes deforestation. What is deforestation? It is cutting down of trees for the conversion of forest to non-forest land. What are the causes of deforestation? The first cause is urban development. Sometimes there is flow forest degradation and but sometimes there is sudden cutting of trees for urban development. The second cause is cultivation. Deforestation may be the result of deliberate removal of forest for wood, agriculture or urban development. For example, houses, roads and building etc. Then comes effects of deforestation. First of all, degradation of environment. Deforestation has resulted in a degraded environment with reduced biodiversity means by the degradation of environment our biodiversity is lesser. The second thing is the amount of water and moisture. Deforestation affects the amount of water and moisture in the atmosphere. The third thing is soil erosion. It is the disease of soil. Soil erosion. Trees keep the soil in place. When there are no trees to keep the soil in place, the soil becomes ripe for erosion. Ripe means ready. Erosion is a disease of soil. in which soil fertility is lesser. Source of flood Due to deforestation, there is less protection from wind and rain. Heavily rainfall washes the soil into the river, essential nutrients washed out and rivers become choked up with mud and slit. 
which can cause flood then comes reduction in the source of rains deforestation decreases the transpiration what is transpiration transpiration is the loss of water from the surface of leaf now what is reduction in the sources of rains deforestation decreases the transpiration which lessens cloud formation and humidity this ultimately reduces the sources of rains now come to advantages of forest support of biodiversity forest support considerable to biodiversity and provide valuable habitat for wildlife then the second advantage is source of medicinal conservation forest act as medicinal conservation it provides sources directly or indirectly then comes utilization of forest product utilization means use of forest products there is utilization of many forest products there is use of timber fuel wood this use has played a key role in human societies and this is comparable to the roles of water and land too then come source of um, timber today developed countries are using timber for building houses they use wood pulp wood pulp is the um, material which are extracted from wood they are also used for making paper threats to biodiversity <coughs> in pakistan <coughs> sorry to in pakistan to um, deforestation is a great threat to biodiversity the closed canopy forest are shrinking at approximately 1% per year in the province kp now comes what is over hunting first of all over hunting has a significant co- cause of extinction and endangered of hundred of and hundred of species commercial hunting is the principal threat now comes conservation of biodiversity conservation means protection of all those things that affect directly or indirectly the life of living organisms present on earth means they conserve the biodiversity by global concern they demanded that the laws should be a um, definable to species which are threatened by extinction and must be protected threats to biological resources in pakistan pakistan is rich in biodiversity but faces severe threats severe threats means intense threats to its biological resources the greatest concern is the continuous loss of species and natural habitats 
natural habitat the place of living which are present naturally then come causes of loss of species and habitats the first cause is rapid growth in human population means increase in population causes loss of habitat and causes loss of biodiversity the second cause is prevailing poverty in the rural areas of pakistan prevailing means spreading poverty in the rural areas of pakistan third thing is low literacy rate means ratio of education is less is the third cause fourth one is less resources now comes organizations and projects work to conserve species and habitat the first is national conservation strategy in 1980s the iucn and the government of pakistan formulated the conservation strategy for pakistan for the conservation of pakistan's biodiversity the second is un convention on combating desertification it is abbreviated as ccd this is an international territory against the damage and poverty in the dry lands pakistan signed this in 1997 the third one is himalayan himalayan jungle project it is started in 1991 in the pelas valley khyber pakhtun kham it aimed at protecting one of the richest areas of biodiversity in pakistan the fourth one is conservation of biodiversity of the suleiman range the suleiman range of chilkoza forest is the largest one in the world in 1992 the wwf p started its conservation program the next one comes northern area conservation project what it do chitral lies on the migratory the northern areas of pakistan serve as habitat for a number of wildlife species the survival of these species is under threat the nacp is a project of wwf p which is successful in implementing a ban on the hunting of those species then comes conservation of migratory birds in chitral kp chitral lies on the migratory route migration means movement of birds from one area to another migratory route of several important bird species these birds faces enormous hunting pressure enormous means large wwf p pakistan initiated efforts to reduce the hunting pressure in 1992 these efforts proved successful then conservation of chiltern marhor WWFP Pakistan developed the management plan of the park and Marhor is national animal of Pakistan. The last one is ban on games. Foreigners visited the northern areas and play many games in which beers are used. WWFP Pakistan has successfully imposing a ban on this illegal practices now come to 
endangered species in Pakistan. Three are listed here. The first one is Indus dolphin. The second one is Marco Polo sheep. And the third one is Hubara bustard. These pages are taken from your book showing the topic of deforestation and overhunting including causes, effects and advantages. Then comes overhunting, steps for the conservation of biodiversity. The First one is National Conservation Strategy, then UN Convention on Comparting Desertification CCD. Third is Himalayan Jungle Project, Conservation of Biodiversity of the Suleiman Range, and so on. The last one is Endangered Species in Pakistan. Marco Polo sheep, Hubara bustard, and Indus dolphin. Thank you.